All right. I have a request um, from Dalai Lama's human, who is amazing, to explain weasel ranching. Uh, so this is a mental game that I play to help me survive certain super shitty situations. So a great example of this is if you are stuck going to a funeral with just no's um, or people who hate you or people who are going to try to pull some sort of emotional manipulation shenanigans bullshit while you're at a funeral. So here's what you do. You, in your mind are a weasel rancher. You have ferrets and a honey badger, or whatever weasels you like. Pick whichever weasels make you happiest. But the problem is those weasels are tricksy little bastards, and you are constantly having to be on the move, because there's a dozen of them, at least. So Fat Larry is trying to pour rum into the punch, and you just can't have a spiked punch at a funeral. So there you are, and some wicked bitch from your past comes up to you and tries to be a smarmy, nasty bitch at the funeral. So, but, but you're a busy weasel rancher. What you do is you go, oh, it's, you know, I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm here just for the purpose of supporting the family or, um, you know, sharing my regrets or for your wedding. Like, we're here to celebrate so-and-so's union. And then you spot your weasels doing something naughty. And then you go, oh, uh, pardon me, I have to go take care of something. And you jet to take care of your crazy, wacky weasel and to stop it from, you know, um, uh, giving your uh, great uncle 16 Valium and 14, uh, uh, you know, upper, <laughs> uh, weenie upper pills to, uh, to completely destroy the reception. So, like, you just, you got to keep on top of those wacky, wacky weasels. Who knows what they will do? I mean, they'll drop cherry bombs in the toilets. They'll do all of that stuff. So, literally, all you do is, like, oh, I'm here for the express purpose of, blur. I'm so sorry. There's something I have to do over there. And you move. You just never, ever, ever stay still long enough for them to, uh, sorry, I'm driving. Uh, very slowly, as you can see, I'm in a parking lot. Um, but you never, ever stay still long enough for them to get to you. And, um, this works if like you have to see your abuser at a wedding or anything else along those lines. And other than that, you just gloriously pretend they don't exist. It's one step past gray rocking. It's full on like Norwegian freeze out. You just they don't exist to you. You don't mean mug them. You don't do nasty things. You just completely freeze them out. Unless they talk to you, in which case you make your excuse because Wiggly Tim is about to uh, throw one of the toddlers like a bowling uh, ball into a pile of little old ladies and you just can't have your weasels doing that. So, weasel ranching, just coming up with the weird shit that your weasels are doing will give you enough to focus on that it'll stop the anxiety attack and the panic. That's, that's, that is the, that's the trick. It's also fun, and, uh, if you're playing it with someone else, you can, you can compare notes on what your weasels are doing through the event, and it helps keep you sane. So, I hope that is useful. Thank you, Dolly. Asta.